You have to choose between the ones that you love the most in life. Your kid, your wife, or your mother. I want to put mumsy, wifey, you. <laughs> really? <laughs> Taylor Swift is becoming an issue for my marriage. I cried with her to Dorothy a couple times, and I maintain that <laughs> August. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> you know the, those two Asian guys who are like, oh, I've been on MASH recently. Like, why can't we go viral with some dumb thing like that, man? Yo, I've been on kidney beans recently. <laughs> I've been on naan recently. I've been on peshwari, bro. Garlic. Gima. What's wrong with you? Bro, you have an issue. Welcome back to the fourth attempt, the fifth attempt, the third attempt. The, I don't even know how many attempts. Yeah, start again, start again. Uh, start off the air, uh, shut up. Oh my God. Uh, to episode 48 of the Atypical Podcast. We are glad that you are all joining us here today. Um, <clears throat> how's okay. everyone doing? What's going on? Yeah. Yeah, what You're about to say your you? vows. <laughs> yes, I I will. Okay. yes i will <laughs> yes i will <laughs> bob the builder bruv <laughs> what are you not saying i know hums is a bit ill hums is trying to trying to pull bit. through <clears throat> doing good how you look then yeah my brain is firing on no cylinders right now <sighs> yeah i can tell we won't come to you for any facts <laughs> we never do anyway we shouldn't That's very true i've ruled a thumb definitely <laughs> Uh, we like saying same shit different week has anyone done anything interesting or should we just no, crack brother. on because no one's crack done anything on, interesting. I, I, well no listen we have come on man we have to this is the what was the most boring but we shit. haven't done anything though something must have happened in your lives bro like four in two hours weeks on, time four hours spent four hours on looking hotels and debating last night how'd it go what'd you find did you find one with a pool table where you can crack all the tiles nah you know what did we talk about that did we actually talk about it? did we talk oh, about shit. our sick Airbnb <laughs> in Greece no <laughs> we didn't but we can yeah let's do it let's on. do it go ahead Hamza <laughs> <laughs> this guy is the king of like creating topics and then not talking about it uh, yeah, we were in Greece, last time. if you remember, from the Atypical Athens Adventures episode, go check it out. And we had this really, really nice um, Airbnb. We had like a sick view of the Acropolis, had like a little balcony, had a rooftop, had a pool table. It was sick. And then we went in there and one of the sockets in Mano Masan's room was just broken. And then the uh, like curtains, the blinds were like one tap away from breaking. Spoiler alert, they broke. Um, and then there was many times when we were playing pool <laughs> and it was tiled flooring um, where the pool, one of the pool balls just, you know, blinked itself off the table and uh, hit the floor. I don't think we actually cracked times. anything on the floor, though. Um, I think we made a dent. Definitely That's did. That's what we told. I think there was the one owner. or two dents. Yeah. There, were, there was but definitely chipping. Else, there was definitely no, 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 no. I'm pretty sure there wasn't chipping. No, no. no I, sure. I remember a certain person chipped and then put the tile back. Who? Yeah, that Who definitely that? happened. Who was that? That was Hamza. Who was that? Really? I was, I was 100% Hamza. <laughs> really? Yeah. It was like this, this fat chunk chipped off and he just stomped it back in. What did you say about chunks? <laughs> Kit Kat Junkie. <laughs> Kit Kat, yeah, mate. Kit Kat Junkie. Uh, what, didn't the, the, the curtains close? They uh, broke, right? What was yeah, it? we yeah. touched them broke. and they just fell off. Oh, yes. yeah. That yeah, was the really Harsh's broken. magical yeah. touch. Mm-hmm. Right, yeah, and the Airbnb I I owner tried to make us pay for it or something, right? Yeah. Didn't he have an argument, yeah. debate with Nah, him? he tried arguing and we were like, bro, it was literally already broken. He Did he pay us... for it in the end? No. No, we, no, we didn't do anything. No. He, he wrote us a, a, ve- a very bad review. Yeah. It's like, whatever, bro. Who's so, account was that? Hamza's. <laughs> I don't care. I've got a good rating <laughs> yeah, from everyone else that I've been to, bro. I've got five out of fives. I don't Jeez. care if I make one guy. <laughs> mm, no, 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 but Hamza, we know when it comes to ratings, even one... Even one one out of five is a very big deal. Yeah, yeah. What middle? What, what, what hotel this? would you guys go? To? If you were going to a hotel, yeah. What you know the customer ratings? Yeah. What would be the minimum that you'd be willing to accept to like book that hotel? So what? Jay's a Tory, so he's nine point five bro minimum. Yeah. Out of ten. <laughs> <Okay>. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what do you mean? You mean as in if you just go on like booking. a booking com. site? Yeah, any booking, booking site. Com. Yeah, yeah. Um. As, as long as as long as cle- cleanliness is five out of five, then nah, like uh, overall rating, overall rating, is now out of five. It's out of ten. No, I wouldn't out of five out of ten. Out of ten. I wouldn't oh. go below three. three. No, out of ten. Out of ten. Oh, out of ten. Okay, well then six. Just double. Reach you six. Okay, fair. Well, yeah, I wouldn't go below that. But you know, yeah. if it's me, then I'll just book eight or nine out of ten in it. Yeah, Why would you do what? any different? Yeah, I agree. You know. No, no, I, but I you always have say the to, same thing. In, in worst case scenario, what, we, what, how far are you going? How far worst are you case, absolute worst case, probably the same six or seven. Yeah, I wouldn't go below a seven. Really, though, it's a seven point five. 
And what booking yeah. site does that? Uh, booking.com. All of them. All of them do like what, do point fives. Oh, yeah, point one, point two, point three. Seen, That's never seen, never seen, seen that. One. Yeah, I've never seen one below seven. Honestly, <laughs> yeah, hey, just because you know, just because you haven't been looking for hotels, my fam. I have. What do you mean? <laughs> you haven't been <laughs> looking hard <laughs> enough. There are some. Uh, there's one website that does actual either. numbers. Like it'll be sixty-five or whatever, seventy, whatever shit like bro, that. If it's out of a hundred, that's just unnecessary, man. <laughs> it's all the same, brother. No, no, no. Just divide too... by ten. No, but sixty-five out of a hundred is not the same here? as six point five out of ten. Yes, it is. How, what do you mean? Mentally, sixty-five is so far away from a hundred. Six point five. That's right so far away from ten. No, no, no. It's, it's it's, some would say it's the same amount of weight. Some, uh, it's not. Some, one's three, some, one's Every 30. mathematician on the world. Jay. He's so ill. He's no, so Ill. listen, if you see something that I'm like, oh yeah, this is a 70 out of 100. But then you see it's like a 7 out of 10. The 7 out of 10 seems better than the 70 out of 100. Even though, yes, you're correct. Exactly. So yeah. thank you, Nish. Oh, you're a sheep, bro. Absolute sheep. <laughs> I'm just trying to make him. I'm Absolute just trying to help sheep. him, bro. Sheep dog. Anyway, I want to talk about the hotel <laughs> stuff. So, um, <laughs> We spent four hours discussing it, and there was this long, arduous debate. And the funny thing is, we came to a conclusion, and Hamza immediately is like, "Nah, I don't really like it." <laughs> after booking, Why? after booking, oh, after booking, after booking. You pay yeah. cancellation, free, free cancellation. cancellation. Oh, yeah, yeah. don't worry, not not that. Don't Why worry. would you do that after though? Because I didn't want to book it in the first place, but everyone else was crying. So I just stayed quiet to satisfy them, and I'll so go change it. This is week. this is basically the debate, and this is what I said by the way. This Lim- guy is the most high maintenance guy. No, no, no. Ever. To be fair, to be fair, Speak I, I agree shit. with Hamza. I agree with Hamza in premise. What it was, it was between two hotels. For people who don't know, we're planning a trip to go to Japan. Hamza's planning a majority. What was this for? Tokyo? Overwhelmingly, yeah, this is for Tokyo. So we're trying to Osaka and Kyoto, all calm, all all blessed. Actually, really good hotels. And when it comes to Tokyo, there was essentially two debates between two hotels specifically. For people who don't know, Tokyo, massive, innit? If you don't know, then you're a bit stupid. And Akihabara is like the weeb central, like electronics, anime central district, okay? Yeah. Shinjuku and Shibuya are like the more, they're, they're the two more well-known. Those are like, I can't think of a London equivalent, but it's like flipping. Hamza, can you think of what London equivalent? Knightsbridge and... Actually, oh. that's probably Roppongi. I don't know. Anyway, yeah. it's pristine. It's pristine. That's the main two. Uh, it's right? shortage. It would be shortage. Right. It's shortage nice. is so it's nice. them once. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So, like, right. people don't know the classic Tokyo Crossing. That's in Shibuya, for example. Shibuya Crossing. Yeah. Oh, Where, yeah. Which and part is the Tokyo Tower in? Tokyo Tower is in Just south. below Chua City. It's like yeah, south. It's in Chua City, yeah. Chua City. It's in Chua, Chua. City. <laughs> Chua. <laughs> yeah, yeah. So, uh, so, just imagine this on a map, right? Imagine there's an imperial palace in the middle, okay? It separates wow. the majority of the, the main inner district, okay? Akihabara is northeast, roughly, more towards north. And Shibuya and Shinjuku are all on the west coast, right? Not really coast. West but you coast. Can get, you can get what I'm trying to get at. And essentially, the debate was <laughs> me and Hamza were like, let's stay in Shinjuku because we want to leave the hotel and be in like, you know, an interesting nightlife area within 15, 20 minute walk. I <laughs> you two want to do nightlife. Way. Walk, walk through the city, bro. Oh, so cityscape, not yeah, like that. That's two no. different things, my brother. It's still the same stuff because <laughs> de- de- derailing my story once again. Let me just get to it. And then, um, <laughs> what the debate was, what the debate was, is Hamza, even though I said incessant on the call, told him because everybody wants to stay in Akihabara. We ended up staying in Akihabara. That's why we booked it. But the thing is, they don't. They just, they just don't have a clue what's going on, so they're just saying, oh, yeah, the hotel's nice, let's pick that. Then well, I mean, No one's actually considered the location. I said that say. consistently. I was like, bruh, let's go to Shinjuku. I was, only, I was the only guy on his team. I was like, listen, Hamza is not going to like Akihabara. It's the one place he ain't going to like. What's the weeb shit that he's going to get there? He's going to hate it. There's no point. And for context, to get to Shibuya Shinjuku <laughs> is an hour and a half walk, for example. Yeah, you get a bus skate. or the train, in it. Yeah, but there'll be... The uh, eleven o'clock, ten o'clock, whatever time they close, right? So it's right, kind okay. of lock off. Sure. So that's where the debate is, and that's why it's hilarious because I was like, "I'm saying gonna like Akihabara. I'm saying gonna like Akihabara." He didn't. I'm didn't fight at all. And then as soon as we get off the call, he was like, "Yeah, I'm gonna look for other hotels. I'm not staying in Akihabara." And I'm like, "Well, what the <laughs> fit was the point of that, man?" Yeah, so have you guys finally minute. decided to split up, or is there, is everyone still staying in the same hotel? We, I think, I think realistically, we're gonna end up splitting up because I'm um, slap some dosh down for a better hotel, which I'm sure some people wouldn't want to do. So, 
um yeah but we're staying together for Kyoto and osaka it's just tokyo which is a bit touch and go yeah fair yeah. what there do you guys go. prioritize when you're booking hotels Vacation, storage, cleanliness. What are we saying? Number one factor, Jason, cleanliness. Cleanliness and quality, yeah. Yeah, if I'm going abroad or something like that, if it's like um, an occasion, then quality. Fairs. I value a snooker, snooker table. That's me. Or a pool table. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. My number yeah, one. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I value a view of the yeah, Acropolis. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or whatever country you're in. I was looking yeah, for memes. face Acropolis. I was looking for memes yesterday on what Marriott hotels they got around there and the Mount Fuji one you can get uh, the hot the hot spring up to your room so they get like a Ooh. hot spring hot tub in your room that is elite and the view that's of Mount Fuji length. oh, oh that's yeah, hard you know how much that's going to be a night an arm and a leg and a flipping another arm and a it leg it wasn't even that much to be fair it was <laughs> like ever... it was like 180 a night oh yeah, that's not bad at all it wasn't that bad at all yeah yeah but it's, that's a single bed yeah no twin room team because we'll be looking bed twin reveal room. Yourself. That was a uh, their their prices for twins and doubles are the same. That's <laughs> that's sick. <laughs> what um what what what's your guys' bucket list lo- location that you guys want to visit in the world? Oh, so many, bro. That's way too. Uh, I'll pick one. Any? I I want to go to um Bora Bora. Mm. Bora Bora. Little holiday resort. A bit basic, in it. Oh, bit, you can say that about every country, brother. No, that's not. Are you true. gonna ask him about his bucket list and there's hate on it? <laughs> Idiot. It's got entertainment. <laughs> that's wild. Nah, this but guy. This guy doesn't even want to go to Japan. Aside. He's going for no reason. Who? Hamza. Hamza. Nah. You're I've not seen, not wrong. I've seen a lot of POIs. <laughs> not there's right. Definitely a lot of POIs. He's waffling. He's doing this, my, he the same. Brother, my happens. POIs was for the sake of putting POIs now. Yeah. A lot of my POIs, I don't even want to go to. You don't want to go Fuji? But that's one of them, isn't it? We've got 280. There's about 50 different things in Fuji, brother. You know, including your... Is that a number you just plucked out? Or have you actually got... Nah, it's it's 259. And I think... Wait, what do you actually want to see, Hamza? Genuine Uh, question. I don't know, bro. Is there anything? Anything at all? Clip that. So you are staying in the right place then? (laughs) <laughs> nah bro I don't know car stuff innit really to be honest oh, okay. <laughs> yeah car Weird stuff car, are you gonna bro. do the rent out uh, an R34 oh, maybe uh, Usman Usman wants to yeah Usman wants to yeah. the Usman thing is what, what side of the road do they drive on left side our side yeah, oh, is it? same apparently yeah. Yeah. What, and you get a UK driver's license is valid international permit which is like really cheap anyway five quid apparently is what I heard yeah. and Usman, five quid yeah Usman international wants... permit it's cheap Wow. You gotta learn the their laws of the road, though, and it'll be very nah, different. Still. Nah, you think nah. you think Brits know about the laws of the road here, brother? Nah, bro. Yeah, that's and that's why you always gotta be vigilant. <laughs> nah, <laughs> people trying to crash into you twenty four seven. But yeah, what's everyone's um, dream locations then? Harsh, you said Bora Bora. Some dead answer. What about you, my Sam and uh, Jay? Such a hater. <laughs> Man, you hate. Uh, it ranges, isn't it? What are we talking? Specify. Just answer the question, innit? What should I have dream plenty location? of places, brother? There's not just one. pick one. Some. Just pick one. It doesn't pick matter one. what it is. Tokyo, oh, crazy. Tokyo. No, other than Japan. Oh you... my god. Pleb. Um, <laughs> I want to. go I didn't get this much time. Boston. I know. Boston. 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 Hard, hard. Boston. Boston. Mass. Sick. Yeah. All right, Jay. Um, if I pick one, <laughs> I do. Re- I do time. really want to go to Cuba. <laughs> Cuba. My brother's been to Cuba. I think that would be Cuba. so. Nice, it would be like just a. You're stuck in a different time. You'd have to go on your own though, not with communism, your man. Socialism and that. Shout uh, out. Yeah, you can sit about. That's what it is. <laughs> Two different things. <laughs> Leaf on the same. Leaf on know. the same branch in it. It's calm. What about you, Hamza? Um, slough in it. Hundred pounds of slough. Shit. Yeah. This guy says New Zealand every time. Yeah, the answer is actually New Zealand. Oh, New Zealand. Yeah, New Zealand. Yeah, hard. Bora Bora is similar to like a yacht in the middle of the ocean. Not this again. Um, Maldives, (laughs) the same vibes. Maldives is also up there for me. 100%. Yeah. 100%. Yeah. Relaxation. Um, Maldives is. The thing. Uh, it's different time, things for different yeah. vibes, though. Harsh is boring, isn't it? <laughs> thing is, though, this that's is what the I just thing. said. Different this... holidays for different vibes. Yeah, this <laughs> is the thing, though. This is the thing, because I feel like it's just, uh, there's a split. On my screen, it's not going to be the same for your screen. But I think me and Hamza are the same line of thinking where we're just like, don't really spend as much time in the hotel as possible. 
all the time outside versus you two who I feel like are definitely more casual about it. Oh, 100%. Hotel. At the hotel. You're more chill. You're yeah, hotel. you do like like a chill all day. You don't want to just no, go out no. and, that and do... It, it entirely depends on the holiday. If I'm going to a holiday, it entirely depends on what I'm going for. There's two different yeah. things in it. Like if you're going, if you're going somewhere that you want to explore and actually see the architecture and see the culture there, that's one thing. But there's something like Bora Bora where you only want to chew at the beach or only nah, architecture. Uh, in Bora Bora, <laughs> yeah, the water, bro. What oh, the it? way it was built. Oh shit! That, yeah. Oh, the way the water yeah. was built, that's new. Yeah. Who said that? Yeah, that's that's architecture of the water. <laughs> <laughs> that's an embarrassing thing to come out of that. That's like the, uh, uh, you know, yeah. the, those two Asian guys who are like, oh, I've been on MASH recently. You seen oh, those guys in Waro? Yeah. Mash. The, ma- oh, the mashed yeah. potato. So yeah, someone yeah, said yeah, that. Mashed potato. Yeah. yeah, I've been on MASH recently. What you <laughs> oh, should have yeah. you put in the chat. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I remember. I remember. I, why can't we go viral for some dumb thing like that, man? Somebody's not stupid. With I'm man. stupid. What do you want me to say? In it, I'll, I'll script it. Yeah, <laughs> in it. Go on, script it. Tell say me something, something right now. Yo, I've He's... been on kidney beans recently. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, lentils. Yeah, I've been on lentils. War star. <laughs> I've been on dal recently. Oh, jeez. Okay. He's rolling that. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. All right. <clears throat> so, why don't we uh, jump into something non, non, non nonsensical? <laughs> What All the right. fit? <laughs> this non- guy's nonsensical. Non- non- nonsensical. I've been sensical. on non recently. I've been on Peshwari, bro. Mine and garlic. Gima. Pussy. Oh, what's, what's wrong with you? Bro, you have <laughs> non- an issue. Non- you have bro. an issue. No, okay. issues. Multiple. Plural. <laughs> this guy's got issues. Put okay. the Jiro in it. What? Oh, please Put move the on to the Jiro, bro. Pick a topic, please. <laughs> okay. All right. All right. All right. Let's go with Massam. See, Massam's got an AFK, so I think I'm gonna put some subway surfers. Hopefully, you guys enjoy subway surfers. If you want to see, by the way, when I like get rid of people's, or not when I get rid of people's cameras, but when their cameras go off and I put subway surfers, if you want to like watch something else, like an episode of Game of Thrones or something, just let me know. And I'll chuck it on. <laughs> <laughs> That's too like, well, well, just, Every time it happens, you put a bit more Game of Thrones. See how long yeah, it takes yeah. us to get through all the seasons. All right, Massam's back. So listen. I've got a question for all of you, okay? Some ultimatums, some alternatives that you man can pick, all right? So yes, let me yes, know. Yes, no, no. What you... There you go. Let me know <laughs> what your choices are. All right, here we go. Option number one, a house with no mortgage. B, a 200K salary a year forever, but you have to work until you're 70. Three, debt free. Four, Free groceries for life or five one thousand pounds a month to fund your passions, interests, and hobbies. You gotta pick two. So a house with no mortgage, two hundred K salary, but you have to work till you're seventy, you're debt free, free groceries for life, or a K a month to spend on your passions and your hobbies. What two are you man picking? Number one. Uh, I have one question. This house with no mortgage. (laughs) Are you saying you can you get the house for free or what? Yeah, 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 yeah. Isn't that a debt though? With a mortgage, you get the house free with no mortgage. But why yeah, would you yeah, not just free. choose that then and choose like a fifty million pound house? No, nah, listen, what? Just... <laughs> Jay, you do this stupidity every time. Just keep it within reason, in it. A normal five six hundred k house. There you go. Mine said normal six hundred k. Okay. Yeah, well, listen, depends where you live, brother. Where we live, it's pretty normal. If I'm debt free, does that mean I get a house with no mortgage? No. no. There's why? loopholes. No, just who you are now. Just whatever debt you do have is gone. Okay, got you. <laughs> All right, a yard and, and no debt. <laughs> You'll go for the yard, wouldn't you? Know? Yeah, yeah. Generally speaking, yeah. Fair you enough. said two, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. What was the other ones? Yard and no debt is guaranteed, I feel like. <laughs> that's easy. 200k salary forever, but you have to work to your 70. And I assume you keep getting 200k after that as well. Debt free, free groceries for life, or a thousand a month to spend on your interests, your hobbies, uh, your passions. What are you guys picking? I'm saying can we, free can we deliberate as well. Sorry, go ahead. Uh, yeah, it's, it's a topic, go mate. You can't come. I'll let myself speak. I'll let myself speak. And I'll, I'll speak I, I know mine. Mine's definitive. Get the house and food, bro. Food. That's what I'm, I'm saying. saying. Can't argue with that, man. Can't yeah. argue with that. Necessity. Shelter and food, bro. That's Shelter what I'm saying. Necessities. I'm done. I just need the clothes on my back, bro. That's the last bit. <laughs> to be fair, I'll do the same. 
50 mil really? house, free food for life. 50 mil house is for this <laughs> Fair broken enough. system. I, I feel like I would also go for free groceries for life because that's just... I'm going waitress after that day, bro. You know what I mean? You know? I ain't going as I'm getting kidney beans. <laughs> <laughs> getting mash. <laughs> hey, yo. Potato. You're going to be on mash your whole life. Potato, you gotta, potato. Mash am. You got to do, um, you gotta do with the Brummie accent, bro, innit? That's how you get the views. I can't. I don't even. Uh, I don't even know where to Luke start. From, Luke from Birmingham. Shout out to the man. I'm gonna get that. mash. Oh yeah. <laughs> I would probably do free groceries for life, and then yeah, I can't lie. I probably get house no mortgage, and I probably just sell the house, and then it's like put it on in black. Right. So he could do it, but we can't do that. I didn't say you can sell it. <laughs> if I speak. <laughs> Hey, I didn't ask the question. I just, I just answered it. You definitely opinion. asked the question. I didn't, ask, I didn't, I didn't say, facilitate. can I do that? I said I was going to do that. This right. is different. <laughs> this is so joking. All right, but there you go. Wait, That's no, wait. Oh, what's Harshie's oh, answer? Yeah. Harshie, what's your answer again? He did. Yeah. Oh, I did yard and no debt. House, house and no mortgage. Oh, but you said you wanted to deliberate. What was after that? Oh, no, it's fine. It's not worth it. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> it's okay. All right, I've got a second question for all of you. All right. Yes, Similar please. vibe, right? Similar vibe. Okay. This one, I've been seeing it a lot lately, all right? I'm pretty sure we haven't talked about it. So, you have to choose between the ones that you love the most in life. What are you picking? What's the order between your mother, your wife, <sighs> and your kids? Brother, I've had this. Trois. Oh, my God. It's the uh, daughter, wife, and mum thing. That's yeah, yeah, yeah. Your kid, your wife, or your mother. And I'll, I'll say a little bit of thingy, yeah? A little bit of... Because I know Jay's going to start asking some dumb questions in about three seconds. I was about right? to say... Let's say you've been married for <laughs> 10 years, right? And your kid is, let's say they're five years old. Happy happy, happy marriage, everything's cushy. Your mum's, you know, she's alive as well. She's blah, blah, blah. So yeah, there you go. Can That's I go premise. first? Because I, I know these Absolutely, two are going to disagree. Mate. I know these two are going to have to do the uh, politically correct answer here. Am I? Go on. You're talking to me. Okay, then you go ahead. What are you going to say? <laughs> you go ahead. Say, is it is it is it save one person or is it order them in order, put them in order, or is it save one person out of the three? Yeah, normally the question is one you person has to die, them. right? Yeah, I chill. No, I kill my kid. I'll make another one. It's kind of like burning cows who you <laughs> save first. So okay, that's mad. Mum's big mum, bro. It's a burning cows who you saving first sort of thing in it. Like <laughs> oh okay, who are you I'm prioritizing go. in your life, like okay. day to day, like yeah. Day to day. There's no murdering going on here. So just oh. Day to day. <coughs> so who am I rescuing last? Day to day kid. is irrelevant, actually, because that's obviously going to be a kid. But yeah, you know what I mean, bro. Just ask the question. Then. Thanks. Uh, I'm saying I can't believe what this guy just kid. Said. I'm saying kid, kid, mum, wife. Daughter, mum, wife. <laughs> that's what Interesting. Interesting. I could guess Hobbin's answer. I can't learn. Interesting. Hoshi, what are you saying? Jay, what are you saying? I haven't even thought about it, so I'm going to do that while you guys... That's crazy, because you've had this question for a while. Yeah, that's no, crazy. it's been going through my head, bouncing back and forth, I can't lie. But yeah, what, Just what, what pick the first one that what? comes to mind, innit? Can you just explain the question one more time? So no one's dying here. This ain't like three people have no drowned off dying. a bridge. No one's dying, no one's dying. man. That's boring, no one's dying. Man. Which one are you picking between your mom, your wife, and your daughter? That's what the actual question is. Hamza did some weird contraption, weird... No, I was trying to, because I knew he'd asked the question that you just asked, didn't I? so I just preempted it. Fine. Pick some fun. You, you mean pick how though? Like pick how, bro? <laughs> Who are you prioritizing first? Like, who's most important to you? Are they dying though? Shout, shout. Yeah. Not are today. Not today. <laughs> <They're dying. Okay. laughs> That's the, the question bed. normally, bro. Who are you saving? Out of the okay, but well, it's not the question now. Oh, so... dude, I don't want to answer. <laughs> okay, I'm sorry. I'm joking. I'm joking. I'm joking. Um, you don't have to. Uh, yeah, to be fair, you don't have to. <laughs> you don't have to. That's a good point. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I was gonna say I'll save. I would put, I would put Mumsy, wifey, you. <laughs> really, a hundred percent, bro. Are you dumb? It's mum. That's. Crazy. I wouldn't be here without no, I agree. her. I agree. I agree. That's why she's second. But yeah, That's no, hundred percent. Wifey, wifey, because literally, my as this is what like I'm prioritizing my kid in what way? What am I doing? Like, we can raise our kid together. <laughs> my, my kid my kid is my last priority when it comes to my mother and my, my wife 100%. this guy is screaming red flags nah, you this know is what? crazy it's not a PC answer Hoshi. I was wrong I take that back <laughs> come on brother that's it's the wildest mom. order you could give nah I'm so glad you said that that's a good clip thank you very much go for it go for it bro. <laughs> now, after I don't see what's like, wrong with lads I was lying I was lying oh. I was lying. <laughs> now, 
<laughs> no, I actually want to. I want to debate. What's wrong with it? I, Jay, I want what's to understand your answer? Your perspective. Oh, this question's too hard. Probably. Oh, thing is, I don't give a fuck about kids, man. Um, That's what I'm saying, bro. It's yeah, these, are these Indian guys are godless Indian individuals. Indian Indian yeah, tax, godless they individuals. Billions, bro. They got billions of them, bro. They don't, Facts. They lost. They've been desensitized the, to kids. Why have we got two balls for, bro? <laughs> all right, all right. So in this situation, what do you say? The kids five. Yeah, kids like, five and you I, for if, ten if years. I, if I made the decision where I've had a kid and they're five, then the kid has to be first. The kid has okay. to be first. So I'd go. Oh, long day, kid. <laughs> kid don't worry, nobody's listening. Kid, mum, Literally. wife, probably, or kid, wife, mum. One of those two. All right. Okay. So just just to clarify, so Hashi said, mum, wife, kid. Yes. Masam yes. said. Kid, mum, wife. Yeah. And then Jay, what did you say? <clears throat> oh, you said no. the same, I think. I can't make a decision. I, I'll be different. Kid, wife, mum. Sure. What Kid, the wife, fuck? Mom. You can't, just, you no, can't no, no, change no, no. it for pick, the sake of it. Pick the answer you want, though, innit? Pick the answer you actually think. The most, the most. Like, even if you can't settle on one, which one do you, which one are you most inclined <laughs> to be? It's a judgment-free zone. Never been even so though stumped. we're judging. Jay has never been more stumped in his whole life, bro. Hamza, do you want to say your answer in the meantime? No, honestly, I was just writing yours down just so I could like look at your answers. I have my then choose, isn't it? No, no. no. <laughs> <laughs> choose. And then gang up on the other two. I kid. see that is. Did it? <laughs> Masa, you were kid, mum, wife. Or was kid. it wife, kid, mum? Yeah, kid, mum, wife. Yeah. yeah Harshies was just <sighs> mental. <laughs> you can't. You can't. You're not getting a reaction, bro. I see nothing wrong with my answer. Yo, I see everything wrong with your answer. <laughs> <laughs> This is the hardest so. topic ever. Mum, kid. Wait, what was yours? Mum, wife, kid, Hashi? Mum, wife, kid, yeah. That's mental. <laughs> okay, so I'll give my, I'll give my, my answer. Okay, <laughs> this yeah, guy's like, if, if I worked out all the matrices. In it, literally, you know, you put fucking the matrices. It's actually you matrices. Fucking, it's scary. This guy done fucking, what's it called? The game, bruv. With the set Just, squares and shit. <laughs> the set about. squares? <laughs> I don't know what this guy's doing. Oh, he's got mad just do it, one. Do your answer, bro. Um, all right. So, yeah, I would probably put my kid first. No brainer. If you don't do that, you're Satanist. Then I'd... <laughs> and then, second, I'll probably put my wife, and then third, I'll probably put my mum. That is fucked, you know. That's, That's your own wait, mother, you know, your you blood know, and fucking you flesh. Can have four of those, your bro. flesh, your you blood. She gave mom. birth to you. You wouldn't be here. You wouldn't be here with your mother, bro. But what, do you, what is your kid going to be thinking when you just leave them? What do you mean? Listen, you gave birth this? to them. That's your own child. Yeah. Yeah, but I'm not leaving you them. You murdered just, your child. This, this, see, now we're changing the question. <laughs> now we're changing the question. He's a, he's the question right. should be who are you saving? Because then it's pattern, bro. Then it makes sense. What are we doing? Just prioritize. You're putting people in order, bro. Who do you love sense. the most, bro? Yeah, I don't have a yeah. kid yet, bro. How There's do you know? How do you love someone you don't have, have yet? Oh, you're dumb. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, that's why it doesn't make sense for you two to even answer. <laughs> you, you haven't got a wife. How you're can right. you prioritize no, someone that you, you don't have? <laughs> I have someone I consider my wife. Nah, in my head, my wife. They'll put a ring on it. If you like, you, you can share. You have a mum and you put a last. You have a mum and you put a last. True. Brother. I want you to Thank know that. you. True. You're the only one who put your mum f- first. Exactly. Because I have one and I love her. <laughs> but you're <laughs> saying you also you you're also saying you have someone you consider your wife. Yes. Yeah. And I put a second. And oh. she and I feel like if it comes if it comes down to it, my my wife or my girl at the moment would expect me to treat my mother on a certain level. I'm not saying that my wife my wife is considered better or worse than my mother I'm just saying if it comes down to it if I need to save one <laughs> it comes down to it. you know what is it I think no, I think I think your mum obviously your mum is your mum right that's a special place that no one can ever like no one can you know, ever replace that right it's unique in that sense right but I think that and I'm just thinking out loud here but I think that after you've had kid or kids right and you've been married to your wife a lot like we said 10 years right like it's secure like Ain't going nowhere. Say no freaking Angelina Jolie thing. Yeah, it's like it's secure. Might right? be. Well, it's not in, this not in this scenario. Not in this scenario, brother. Um, yeah, I didn't care. I feel like at that well. point, I feel like at that point, you're because you could potentially have more kids with your wife, etc. As well, that's when the mum gets put to third place. Like even though that doesn't necessarily mean you love her less, or the lesser you just said, or anything. You just said, but, who do you love most, bro? 
No, I also said like who you saving for. I said a lot of things. <laughs> but, okay, no, he, I said who you did, saving for. You, you really. This is what I think. I you fucked yourself. Yeah. No, I said a lot of different things. But my answer is still my answer. My answer <laughs> no, is fair, fair. This fair. is what I think. Well, if we're, mind, no one's dying, priority, I would probably be the first time in my life I'd have to agree with Hamza. I would do kid, wife, mom because, <laughs> Sorry, <my> <laughs> because, yeah, I never agree with this dog because he's always wrong. But point is, <laughs> your mom is always going to be your mom, right? Regardless, if Unless if you put if you put your wife last, you may not have a wife in X amount of time, but you're always going to have your mom. So Who's putting their wife last though? Me. He is. You put your yeah. wife last, yeah. and you're putting your kid last, so your kid's going to hate you for life. I'm not putting my kid last in a sense. All we're saying is prioritizing in what way. If all are, all three people in that situation has something that I need to attend to, is that what we're doing? Yeah. Let's okay, look at it this it. way. Person one, you put the most attention to. Person two, you put half attention to. Things don't always go right between you because you're a bit distant. Person three, you're just neglecting. That's I don't see that as prioritization. Though. I see it as like... Who are you spending the most time with? Prioritization is if someone is. You spend in more need, time with your mom than your wife. Uh, so your me, kid. Listen to me. If I'm saying if it comes down to priority in the sense that they they are someone in need, my wife can take care of my child. If my mom is fucking having a heart attack, I'm gonna be there first. You know what I'm saying? If it's that's that's the way I'm seeing it. If it's if it's the way you guys are framing it in where it's like oh it's the, the person I spend the most amount of time with, then it's kind of different. That's not how I take it, take it, to be fair. I Honestly, I blame Hamza because he put the, the situation behind the question was horrendous. I don't get it. Off, I don't understand it. No, it wasn't horrendous. It just wasn't what you wanted. There's a difference. You started off saying the house is burning, brother. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> the stick to, the, stick the to house the is burning. So in that, so in that regards, one person's dying. Yeah, one person is sure. dying. So who's dying? Um, oh, sure, your kid's dead. My kid is gone. <laughs> my kid is Chris my kid is nah, a fucking it's, it's that's how you know this guy that. just has not uh, in a non non tea way not spent enough time around kids bro. Uh, brother I'm actually so ask anyone that I've like, asked my parents ask my, my girl I am so good with children it's just the fact that I know my mum is my mum bro and my, my wife is my wife like it's it, come on like I can make what it if, what if, okay here's, a, here's another question for you what if your wife can never have another kid like that's your only kid what about what then this guy is adding so much bullshit. No, no, no. I'm asking about his opinion. About oh, I'm just asking his opinion. Yeah, Hoshu, Imagine your kid is quadriplegic. <laughs> <laughs> then it's kind of peak, though, isn't it? They can't run out themselves, so I have to wow, kind of help. Yeah, no, no, but I'm just weird. asking because I'm just trying to figure out how he sees different relationships. That's why I'm asking it. This, see, it's called expanding the question, Jay. You know, discussion. See, when Jay Special does that, guy. it's a problem. But when you do, no, he just asks unnecessary questions. No, because he's got an agenda, right, against intellectuals. That's all it is. <laughs> Yeah. <laughs> Go on, Hashi. No, I get it. I get it. Um, the way I see it is, yeah, is my mom is the person that gave me life. I have a an immense amount of love for her. It's impossible. My kid in this scenario is it five as well? Is the kid five too? Yeah. yeah, yeah. <laughs> it, <laughs> okay. Let me put it this way. I'm going to save the person who is the closest to me in the fire, bro. If the room is, if the room is there, <laughs> they're, they're, all, the case, they're all together. Says, they're dog. all together. They're all together. <laughs> this is ass cheeks, right, bro. Let, this guy's resorted to saying, "Who is in my proximity?" They're getting saying, <laughs> "Who's in, who's the, in the area, chat? bro?" All right, but if it, if it, I've known, I've known my wife for a longer time. They would want me to save my child first, right? It's it's guaranteed, yeah. and my mom yeah. would want my mom. By logic, my mom would be the last person to save. But I, I, I would, I would want to save my kid. This last guy's time. argument is, <laughs> his argument now. His argument now is, I've known my kid the least amount of time. It's their fault they're five. I don't mean it. Hold it. Hold it, bro. You you can never have another kid ever again. Listen, my love is my love, isn't it? You can never have another kid ever again. I'll adopt one. Kids are the reason of, they're the purpose and the meaning of life, bro. I'll adopt one, bro. <laughs> no, according to Hoshi. It's still, it's still a kid. It's this still a kid. You're adopting a child. The man. red flags in the comments going to be going off. You mind in the comments, yeah? Go off on it. Go it's off a hot him. take because the building is fire. Building's on fire. It's a hot take. <laughs> <laughs> bro, bro, can we wow. just... Can we you just ever have a kid? <laughs> can we rewind when he says so that? Like kid, bro. <laughs> can we rewind? Listen, we all say... Can I, can I say one thing, though? Before you, before, you, before you start making more fun of it. You yeah. guys are talking from a perspective of someone who's never had a wife or a girlfriend. Yeah. And hasn't had a child. 
Yeah. I feel like things were, at this moment in time where I am right now, I'm answering it from that perspective. You guys, I feel like, are looking at it from a grand perspective <laughs> and it's like, you haven't had this experience yet. So how could you even... How I, have, you even I, mean, I have nephews and nieces that I've seen since they were born and they're like little... They're like my little kids in a way. So I yeah. can I can consider the perspective of having a kid because I've that seen makes them sense. from birth to yeah. so. And that makes sense as to why you put your wife last because you never had a girl. Exactly. I didn't that. put that's my wife point. last. So who'd you put last? My mom last. Oh, that's even worse. Oh my God. No, you no, actually no, hate no. her. You actually <laughs> hate your mom. No. <laughs> she made us some more sit. Do you fair? Can I just say something, yeah? Um, Jay, you, you know on. what I'm about to say. Uh, according to a certain uh, person, they wouldn't cry if their mom died. <laughs> this guy, bro. This agenda needs to stop because that is not that's, what was said. That's, that's, Who said that? Uh, apparently, I, I said that according to these two, but that's There's just evidence. not true. I have another man with me. It's he not was true. there. He it's was not, literally oh there. It's not so true. you actually don't like your mom? You actually just don't like your mom? <laughs> these guys are waffling. <laughs> I've been waiting, They're waffling. waiting to switch oh up, to switch up the narrative. To <laughs> she raised you for 26 oh. years and you They're don't waffling. like her. They're waffling. You know when you know when um, <laughs> when the police, you know when the police when they interrogate two different like people individually and and they say the exact same thing. That's usually because it's correct. That's all that's <laughs> yeah, no, no, right? no. It's not if you got witnesses with a of lies. We have the same information. Then you cannot uh, be trusted. Can I just say, can I just say Hoshi's oh, story of like his wife, <laughs> his wife and his mom I'll be like, save the kids and he's be like, don't really want to like that. <laughs> the they can hold if it. we're ever sponsored by Save the Children, harsh is gone. Oh if we ever God. get a little uh, partnership with Save the Children, oh harsh is gone. So the good. thing is, let me put it this way, in ten years' time when I have a kid, my opinion will most likely probably change. But right now, I'm asking from my perspective right now as a man. I'm going to tell right your now, kid on so. the daily. Whenever I see them, your dad don't love I'll, I'll tell him myself. And I'll, I'll show them this, this video. clip. I'll show him this yeah. video myself. It's calm, bro. And I'll kick you in the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> we don't condone child with you somewhere. I don't know about you. You, know, you don't love your kid. But, uh, bro, you know. you got to pass the fucking trauma on, innit? <laughs> What's wrong? Not blunt What's force happening? trauma. Not blunt force trauma, brother. <laughs> or any other trauma for that matter. You know, oh. I'm joking, right, Jay? Don't relax, bro. It's oh, okay. He's joking. There you go. Fucking hell. All right. Um, wow. I was joking about my answer, but I'm talking about the trauma. That's oh, what I'm joking about. Of course. You'll let your child burn. The PTSD <laughs> runs deep. Should we, um, should we move on? I feel like. Have you got another ultimatum? <laughs> no, that was it. That's my two. I questions. like these, though. Give us, give, give us more. <laughs> In the comments oh, below. That was yeah, an incredible answer. I'd never thought anyone would put their kid last so fast. Yeah, that's I, I, the debate. The debate normally is between mom and wife. That's the yep. debate. <laughs> never the kid. Listen, listen. I'm different. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> yeah, you tell. We can tell. Yeah, you we can are. tell. Bro. This is kidney beans, brother. All right, should we move on yeah. the next one? Any any next topics? I have a story. It's quite a long story, but it's about marriage. Oh, oh quite long. Ties oh, in perfectly. That's so what I'm saying. But it. Boring. <clears throat> it's a bit long though. <laughs> Anyway, the title of this, right? Seeking perspective, Taylor Swift is becoming an issue for my marriage. I can't believe I just typed that, but here it goes. My wife. <laughs> I love you already. I can't wait. <laughs> what did I say? I can't <laughs> wait. <laughs> it's a bit long. That's what I'm saying. You know, to... It's cold. Oh. All right, my wife, 36, and I, 40, have been married for eight years. During that time, I have to say it's been incredibly smooth. We have little rough patches here and there, but neither of us have broken out the D word divorce what word oh <laughs> yeah yeah thank you uh, this is why he's getting married lost <laughs> yeah, yeah. we've been faithful and we just... <laughs> ha- oh, ha- okay <laughs> marriage no <laughs> where'd you put your wife jay stop Second. stop lad there's Second. a lot there's a lot it was like eight or ten <laughs> first was the fucking okay. thing that comes out of her bro <laughs> <laughs> oh, I can say this somewhere else, but it's gone. It's gone. <laughs> nah, go ahead. Carry on, Mason. No, no, go ahead. I'll PC in it. <laughs> okay, we've had different viewpoints on many issues in the past, but so far we've always been able to get the other person to see our side. I'm not really sure how it's come to this, but for the first time, we both seem to be completely unable to understand where the other person is coming from. We are no longer able to reasonably communicate about an issue that is driving us both insane. Taylor Swift. Okay. Uh, understand you're only getting one side of the story. I'll try to spell out what's going on objectively. <clears throat> right. That said, I feel extremely comfortable calling my wife's fandom Taylor Swift an obsession. I would never say that to her because she would deny it. But that, <laughs> that is what it is. 
Taylor Swift is constantly on her home in our car. She spends multiple hours a day browsing Taylor Swift content That's on nuts. IG and TikTok. She knows everything about all of her theories and all of the relationships, etc. She's been to she's been to two Taylor Swift concerts, East Coast East Coast USA, and is about to go to a third in Europe uh, with a friend. The husbands are tagging along on the trip, but not going to the concert. More on that below. So. He, right. he goes on to explain where the obsession started. I'm not exactly uh, sure when the obsession uh, morphed into something more, but I think it may have started in 2019. I remember Lover had just come out. I'm assuming it's an album. Is that, uh, Single. Is that an album? Right. Yeah, I think in don't 2019. Remember, I, I remember Lover had Song, just come yeah. out and she played it nonstop. She began to talk about Taylor Swift as if she were more than a musical artist, like some kind of spiritual sage or muse. I thought that was a little hard, but fine. Her music was fun and catchy. Then COVID happened and Folklore and Evermore came out. Uh, Some other albums. Yeah, uh, They came out right at the moment where everyone needed a little boost in life. Musically, these albums were a departure from her poppy previous self. Much soft, much softer. By the way, he does his old fan. Anthony Fantano here. He gives a whole review. Mm. <laughs> That's what's going on here. When everything needed a little boost in life, uh, musically, these albums were a departure from her poppy previous self, much softer, darker, and deeper. My wife suddenly lost her mother, with whom she was extremely Ooh. close. Was she was in the Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> she remember the last, bro. Late, later that year, it was a very sad time for our family, and I remember certain songs from the Evermore album being an absolute lifeline to her. The song D- D- uh, D- Dorothy... Sorry, Dorothy. Anyone heard that? Some mother's name. Yeah, <laughs> probably. Honestly, probably. The song Dorothy in particular, it was around this time that I really began to feel like I understood Taylor Swift's music. Right. I, I cried with, with I cried. I cried. <laughs> <laughs> he goes, the guy goes this through This guy's bro. turning into a Swifty. <laughs> he is, I told him. I cried with her to Dorothy a couple of times and I maintain that <laughs> August. Oh, pussy, bro. <laughs> <laughs> told me I didn't say he goes to the Fantano arc here. I cried with her to Dorothy a couple times and I maintain that August is actually still my favourite song I guess I'd seen her as an artist who had evolved from pop culture uh, from pop country to pop to this folky sort of music and I really felt like that was an evolution right there's a, there's a, this one is kind of funny because it links back to what we've said previously. Over the next few years, my <laughs> wife went my wife went deeper into the Taylor Swift world. She bought tons of merchandise. It's rare not to see her wear at least one Taylor Swift themed <laughs> article of clothing. <laughs> 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 he get composure, a, get composure. You need to clip been, this. Get composure. <laughs> he's been trying to it hold it so in for funny, so long. So funny, brother. <laughs> all right, straight face. All right, bought all of her albums on vinyl. Cheered on with the Swifty community as Taylor conquered all of her enemies around the world. <laughs> <laughs> he's a fan. So he he's conquered fan. all of her enemies. <laughs> <laughs> he's a fan bro he's a fan bro all right she's been a mainstay in our lives my wife's staying up for concert album drops constant rotation at home and in the car in the car <clears throat> as i said above she arranged to get tickets to an overseas concert <laughs> and i said i'd gladly join her on the trip i'm an nfl fan was <laughs> he was trying to stay, keep composed oh. yeah bro. <laughs> conquered took me out bro when you said conquered that took me out <laughs> <laughs> that was my favorite bit. <laughs> they conquered all of her enemies and the world. <laughs> all right. oh, you got you, bro. Bro, got this you. is what's funny. It starts because of the NFL. I'm an NFL fan, and although I can't actually, sorry, although I actually thought it was great at first to have her image infused with the brand, I too eventually got, just got sick of seeing her and hearing about her. My wife and I began to discuss this, but I couldn't really get around the opinion that it was my problem. If I didn't like her being all over my life, I think things reached ahead uh, when the last double album came out. Musically, I simply hate it. It feels like a campy regression back to her melodramatic boy crazy days. And I've been honest with my wife about that. This guy that. just wanted to review Swifty. That's all he wanted <laughs> to do. It he's created this story just so he can put out he's a Swifty fan. He wants to review all these albums. I told you, it's Fantano. He did, this guy thinks we're interested for this album review. I really tried hard to hold my tongue when it comes in the house or in the car. But sometimes I can't. <laughs> I tried, I tried to explain to my wife that I'm feeling completely bombarded by her and my wife seems to think that this is a whole point that think that this is the whole point oh okay sorry I let me read that sentence because it's pretty important I've tried to explain to my wife that I'm feeling completely bombarded by her and my wife seems to think that this is the whole point of Taylor Swift I mean I'm sure I'm not properly represented here 
her viewpoint because the conversation just don't go anywhere um there's a lot more there's quite a lot more i'll try to skim some more interesting highlights uh also i don't spend more than five plus hours on them it's probably out of context let me let me go to the last paragraph because there's three more we don't need to get the whole thing <clears throat> we just had a semi-fight while listening to a new album in the car i admittedly was criticizing the music again saying it feels like her old material and understanding why people are obsessed with it i almost almost asked her if she loved taylor swift more than she loved me but i held off on that one we did however discuss the trip to europe which we have since built a vacation around <laughs> and that maybe i shouldn't go <laughs> he's jealous uh, yeah but uh there it is uh that's pretty much the whole story. Uh, yeah, uh, looks else. like they got some uh, bad bud between them, man. Because we're being a Looks like uh, this guy should probably just shake it off. Anyway. Yeah? yeah. Do you want to name any more stuff? Uh, I knew he was trouble, bro. Mm. She was trouble. Yeah, he was in she trouble. She was trouble. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Nah, I said something dumb, though. But yeah, yeah, I just, I just thought that was... Uh, <laughs> that's why you put your wife last, bro. That- <laughs> if she's a swifty yeah you don't get married in yeah first bro um but i just thought like I'd share streams. incredible insane. Um, incredible review I, d- I genuinely don't understand how people can get so obsessed with a celebrity like how, wh- what happens to your brain to think this is my life now revolves around this person i don't know yes yeah, it's, it's normal in kids it's it's okay that's why you kids. hate them <laughs> that's why you hate them yeah <laughs> you see it a lot when you're a teen but you, at some point, you kind of grow out that kind of stuff, right? Yeah, she's I mean, married. I, cool. It's basically, it's literally it idol worshiping. It is idol worshiping. At yeah, that point, sure. when you get that far, you're literally idol worshiping. Brother, he said that she wears an item of clothing every single time. <laughs> That's what. Nuts. Yeah, what was that? Was that like every day? Or uh, let me whenever she's listening mind. to to Taylor? No, That's Jake. No, no, That's it's both. They're, they're both. They're both the same thing, Jay. She's listening to her every day. <laughs> Bro. Every day, bro. Yeah. Was that Taylor Swift flow? <laughs> Taylor Taylor Swift is getting so much bank from this one person. Fuck. That's unbelievable. Oh, sorry. I need to say this last oh bit. Oh, my God. I this need to say this crazy. last bit. I know this sounds like... Uh, sometimes his English is bare busted. Bro, so. she's so mid. Uh, sometimes, Stay on topic. if I'm reading this, I know this sounds sorry. like... Sounds and Wikipedia. then that's the start of a new paragraph, okay? I know the answer is that I should I should probably just get over it, that Taylor Swift is the voice of our generation. I should feel honored to have her being so ever present in my home and that my wife has a healthy a hobby and it's great she can connect so purely to a musical artist. I got a hot take. This is probably mm. going to sound dumb. This is probably going to sound so dumb, yeah? But yeah. I feel like, you know Taylor Swift, massive, right? she's a massive artist. But I feel like she's just got a really big niche. Do you know? Yeah, I, do, do you see what I mean? Like, I know what I mean is what I mean. Niche is white women. Bro. I feel like I don't see her. She's got, she's got a niche no, no, listen, of a billion. Listen, listen, listen. No, yeah, no, listen, niche is white. Women. I feel like I don't see her. I feel like I don't see her plastered all over my social media the way I might do with like Drake, for example, right? Yeah. But she's probably Drake bigger than Drake, right? She's like Definitely the biggest artist in the world, yeah. right? That's so, why I feel like her world has. She's got so many Swifties. She's got. A cult. I feel like they just don't like a yeah, like a cult. But I feel like they just don't like a separate part of the internet. That just doesn't come across your face in a way. Do you, do you see what but I'm trying to say? But I you that. don't I hit those that yeah. demographic. I don't hit the Drake demographic either, brother. I still see no, his shit. No, you would more than yeah. the Taylor. And you you say not interested when you see girls in your explore page. <laughs> I don't have girls in my explore page. You're, exactly, because it's halal. It's not interested. You say not interested. You put them away. So you're, Apart from when you use yeah. the atypical page and the explore page for the kids. You know, <laughs> that's that's nuts. I don't have the account. <laughs> I'm Wikipedia, not going to be thrown under the bus. Her Wikipedia says... <laughs> Her reinventive artistry, distinctive songwriting, and entrepreneurship. Bro, there ain't nothing reinventive about Taylor Swift, bro. No, well, man, that's well, what well, you're well, saying. Evermore well, is so want, different yeah, do you want to, me to go back? bro. Do you want me to go back? I can. There's a lot, but I'll just control F, bro. Control F. That's funny, man. Bro, Dorothy makes you feel a certain way. Bro, I'm it's saying we listen bro. to Dorothy Can't. because I, I heard cried. it. Loki, I heard it. You uh, cried. Obviously, I found this. I cried, bro. <laughs> yeah, I cried. My wife. <laughs> Listen, I think laughter, the reality bro. is, yeah, he enabled her. Yes. And now he's he's reaping what he sowed, and now he doesn't like the harvest, bro. Your fault. Yeah, yeah. That, that's why that's why there was important. I mentioned that last line because even even here, he's like not really sure about himself. Like maybe I'm complaining about yeah. nothing. Like, bro, it's now he's looking at his wife. Like, look what you made me do. It's weird because he's asking. <laughs> he's getting jealous. I'll clip that bit. <laughs> yeah, <thank you. laughs> 
<laughs> oh, that was good. I just clicked. He's he's getting jealous to the extent where he's asking if he loves her more than him. So I feel like it's more of a him problem than she is. She might just be a fan, bro. She might just, all right, cool. She has him playing in the house, this, that, the other. But you liked her so much too. You seem like a fan yourself. And it's getting to a stage where you're like, oh shit, maybe she likes him, her more than me. Which Like he's asking her that himself. I, that I is the like weirdest question She's not going to go see Taylor and start scissoring. Yeah. This is completely Maybe. different. You Maybe have an idol. I feel like you have your husband. He <laughs> loved. Yeah, he loved her. He's saying that, right? He did say that, right? He loved T Swift, right? And he loved her so much. And he was also a big, big, big fan. You've fallen out of being a fan where your wife hasn't, and that's the only issue because you didn't have an issue when you were both fans. You just have an issue now that you've fallen out because her love for yeah, T Swift yeah. is the same now as it was back then. Yeah, so it's yeah. Like, but it's also changed. It's also very not un- to say that it's still yeah. unhealthy to have an obsession yeah, that far. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Not that no, he is on that. Do you want to play maybe. an artist twenty four seven though, and wear all their merch, and maybe yeah, have all their yeah, that's all, all their that's stuff weird. around your house? Like that's that's a lot. Yeah, but he yeah. liked and it. The car, that's, he's Hamza's actually fully right. He he liked it for the longest time, and then the moment that he started getting insecure about it himself, he starts questioning the relationship. That's the yeah. weirdest. Still unhealthy logic. though. That that let me just that um, both both be true. true at the same. Yeah, yeah exactly. Yeah, yeah. Let me just reiterate so this weird. very important sentence. I cried with her to Dorothy a couple of times. Oh, <laughs> it's multiple of times. You guys ever cried listening to music? Yeah, yeah. I think it's I a would, pretty normal I've, thing to cry. One hundred percent. A couple sure. times, the same track. Yeah, one hundred percent. Which yeah. ones? Which ones? Not like, oh, I was about to say something mad. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> Alphabet song, bro. A B C. Happy birthday, bro. <laughs> I'm in love. Because you don't celebrate no more. <laughs> Facts. <laughs> by force, not by choice. Um, couple songs, bro. I can't Which name ones? any off the top of my head, but I remember, I can definitely remember getting goosebumps and chills and actually crying to songs uh-huh. 100%. <laughs> <laughs> I get those goosebumps every time. You get those yeah. goosebumps. Can't wait till we have our own, like, atypical is. And no. uh, they they do Tips. compilations of no Tips. Tips. Yeah. and they uh, start doing compilations on like episode one. Tips. It's a great time, man. Shout out to you, man. One day in it. Oh, Monday. when we get to the point where we can just say Fan clip fiction. that, and there'll be a clip. Oh. crazy! We're gonna have our own Indian YouTube shorts maker. <laughs> uh, excuse me. Yeah, yeah like JJ. Yeah, it makes sense. It makes sense. Why are you making us lot do the do the labor? <laughs> <laughs> they want you, bro. It's called. They they want want you. We need yeah. to find a third party. Target the Sri Lankan. I, I'm, <laughs> say, I'm <laughs> saying we listen to we listen to Dorothy. We do a listen party because I I listen to the first five seconds and I was Shall like, I play it? Yeah, play it. Wait, Go can on, these? Why not? When no, you we're, allowed not, to gonna get we're not. We're not. Gonna we're going to get, gonna gonna get, get done that, from yeah. Swift, brother. So we we, we won't <laughs> do it here. But oh, we can she'll find. She will find. We're not monetized anyway. We're not monetized. It doesn't help. It doesn't help. If if it gets copyright stricken, then the video gets taken down. Yeah. Oh yeah. Right. So All yeah. Right, mute it. <laughs> nah, it's long, bro. But yeah, yeah so it's a long day. <laughs> yeah. There That's work in it. <laughs> Probably something from House of Balloons <laughs> to answer the question, which nobody wanted to answer. It's your job. This guy Say again. Doing anything. Music. Uh, uh, cried to listen to music. Probably something from House of Balloons. I'd have to go back and look there. Oh, back to the question. Oh, 100%. Yeah, yeah. That time was, yeah, it was different. Yeah. Do you what remember s- any songs? What song did you just name? Did you name House it? From Blues. my album, House of Blues Weekend. album. Weekend. Oh. Is the thing is, there's, there's plenty of, yeah, it's a, it's a hard one. Um, while you guys are pondering that question. Oh, Elastic Heart. Elastic Heart by Sia. And for, even sometimes when I hear Chandelier, I'm like, fuck, no, no, no. Is it, yeah, Chandelier. Is it Chandelier? Yeah, I think it's yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. That shit. Oh, bro, when I was young and I heard that shit, bro. Tears, Give a rendition. Bro. I can't. I, it's a high pitched tune, the... bro. <laughs> oh, oh. <laughs> it's getting no, there. I'll up it in. Uh, I'll up it in. Um, in... Yeah, use in free loops. In use free loops, bro. He's saying in post. He's gonna up oh, it. Oh, post. In post. He yeah, I got what you know. Middle of the word. <laughs> Yeah, I was like, what happened there, bro? I'll I'm muted. Mute. <laughs> yeah. Big up. Finish my sentence. Post. But yeah, listen, that guy enabled. Now he's crying that he fallen out, but she's still liking it. Yeah. Sounds pussy. like a you problem. Um, I mean, yeah. You should have known she was trouble when you. Yeah. I she wish did. they were. Were... Okay, I'll stop. I'll just... Yeah. I tried. What would you do in that <laughs> situation, though? What would, what would you do? Uh, probably leave her in the fire, right, Hoshi? 
Yeah. <laughs> Slap her in there with Dorothy. <laughs> Dorothy. Dorothy. <laughs> Uh, yeah, I, honestly, at that point, you got you got to, you got to have the conversations, and if it doesn't get anywhere, then decisions, isn't it? That's a a bro. deeply rooted idolization. To get that out of someone yeah. is a lot of work. <clears throat> it's a lot of work. And he's a, he needs to work on himself to stop being such a bitch, bro. Asking himself, asking if she loves her more than him. That is the weirdest. Like, fair enough, idolization, hundred percent. But firm it, firm it. Do something about it. Yeah, enabler though. I agree with Hamza's immediate yeah. response. 100%. Yeah, if he goes yeah. with her to the concert, what a bitch! What's he yeah. doing? He, 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 in fact, it's not even I've never seen Jay so animated in my it's life. Just that he's <laughs> making a hotel, hotel. He's making a whole vacation out of it, bro. He's planning his whole holiday around that concert to uh, accommodate for his wife. Mm-hmm. And the other thing is, like, wait, didn't he say? Wait, on that though, real quick, didn't he say that the other husbands are doing the same thing? So they're probably making a motive, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's that's uh, fine. The husbands are tagging along on the trip but not going to the concert. And he's going guaranteed to guaranteed the husbands don't even know each other. Fair. They met they met they met each other like four times. It's not like they're mates. Maybe. It's not like they're mates. Oh, yeah. Maybe. Honestly, man, this is this guy has a way of words. His grammar is horrendous. Some some English is here is horrible, and I can't even read right. But this, the whole line about bought all of her albums on the vinyl, cheered on all the Swifty community as Taylor conquered all of her enemies and the world is just, that's unreal. That's the highlight of my <laughs> week. Brother. She's talking about him like she's fu- he's fucking William the Conqueror or something. Yeah, <laughs> no, <laughs> <fucking> <laughs> conquered her William the Conqueror. Like he went to war. <laughs> yeah, yeah normally, normally in that. How much time we got left? Uh we we've, we've just hour. Probably, just, probably just under, yeah. All right, we got Endo and Taylor Swift hate, bro. Swifties yeah. come at us, bro. Come at we're, us. We're still bro. waiting for them to do that. They haven't done it yet. Yeah, yeah we'll our, our Swifty videos get views, you know. Do they? I think I butchered saying this, by the way. No, I they could not hold myself. They this do. is too funny not to uh, crack <laughs> up on, honestly. Yeah, I can't but, lie to you. I, I saw it in your face. <laughs> <laughs> Every two seconds, you're trying so hard, but it was yeah, leaking out of you. Because I've read, because <laughs> I've read this previously. Um, but yeah, should we call it here then? Should we call it here? Yeah, round it off, man. Indeed. <clears throat> Go on, my son. Round it off. Yeah, leave a like and subscribe. If you're a tip fan, make sure you smash that. Tip. The like button, oh. <laughs> yeah, smash the tip, <laughs> smash the tip, aka like the button, and uh, follow <laughs> a typical podcast on all platforms. Yes. Yeah, there we yes. go. Subscribe, all of that good shit. Yeah, Thank you very much. honestly, I've if you made it this far, if, you, if they made it this far, they've probably already subbed in it. Let's be yeah. honest. True say, true say. Yeah, yeah. In a bit. Thank you very much.